Have you ever read an email and then you get to the bottom and there's no signature? Or it just says, thanks, John. Who's John? What does John do? Where does John work? And how do I know that this John person is even legit? Sometimes I check the email signature before even reading the whole email to see if I can ignore it or not. Hey everyone, it's Remy from HubSpot and this week I wanna talk about email signatures, why they're important and why you might wanna upgrade yours. I'm even gonna show you an easy and free HubSpot tool that you can use to write a professional email signature. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and make sure to hit that subscribe button. We all know why email marketing is so important for every business. And if you don't know why, make sure to check out this video right here where we break it down for you. You wanna make sure that you're starting off strong, beginning with the subject line and ending strong with the signature. Here's two signature examples. This one, not bad, it's okay, but it could be better. This one answers all the questions that I as a reader would have. It tells me who John is, what John does, who John works for, and it lets me know that John is legit and I can trust this email. So what is the best way to sign off on your emails? Well, a study done in 2017 looked at 350,000 emails with different sign-offs and found that a simple thanks before your signature came in at 65.7% response rate compared to kind regards, which had a 53.9% response rate. See, these are the kinds of things they did not teach me in college. They told me to write sincerely and that didn't even make it onto this list. Another study found that signatures that included a photo image produced the highest response rates compared to signatures without a photo image. I don't know about you guys, but I get dozens of emails every single day and seeing a photo in the signature definitely adds a bit more trust for me. And it increases my chances of responding too. Okay, let's get to the good stuff. I told you guys that I wanna show you an easy and free tool that you can use. What is this tool you might ask? It's HubSpot's free email signature generator. It's such an effective tool and the best part is you can literally copy and paste the email signature that you created right into your email account. So let's go ahead and jump to that so you can see how quick it is to create a great email signature. The link for HubSpot's free tool is below in the description box, so make sure to check that out. There's six different templates that you can choose from based on your personal preference. Today we're going to use template number three, just because three is my favorite number. This tool is super user friendly, so you'll have no problem using it. Working our way from left to right, let's start off with your signature details. This part is pretty self-explanatory. This answers the who, what, and where information that the reader needs. And let's take a moment to appreciate the people that include their social media links and their signatures. It's 2021. If you are not including this, what are you doing? Providing these links is literally a game changer for your business, and it's such a great way to grow your following too. Next, we're gonna pick our colors. You can change this to the colors of your brand or just your favorite color. Let's do black and orange for Mr. John Smith. You can also change the font and the font size in this tool. Last but most definitely not least, let's add a photo so we can increase those response rates. Adding a photo helps people put a name to a face. You wanna make sure that this is a clear headshot. So this means no mirror selfies. If you don't wanna include one, you can always just use your company logo instead. Now, this last little step is optional, but it's probably one of the best things you can do, especially as a business owner. Include a call to action. You can use this to direct people to a campaign you're launching, to grow your social media accounts, to sign up for exclusive offers, the list goes on and on. The HubSpot tool lets you add CTA copy, a link, or even a photo. Alrighty, everything that the reader needs to see is in the signature, now let's get this copied and pasted into your email account. Once you click create signature, you just want to copy that and open up your email. Depending on your email client, the steps will be slightly different to upload your signature and that's where the FAQ page comes in handy. It breaks down the steps to uploading your signatures in Gmail, Outlook, HubSpot, Apple Mail, and Yahoo. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do it in Gmail and Outlook. So in Gmail, we're going to click on settings, see all settings. Under the general tab, you wanna scroll down until you see the signature section and paste your signature into the text box. Don't forget to save it. If you have an Outlook account instead, the process is almost identical. You're gonna go into your account, click settings, 
Then view all Outlook settings, select Mail, then click on Compose and Reply, paste your signature into the text box, and hit save. All right, guys, that's it for today's video. If you have any questions on email signatures, make sure to leave them down below in the comment section. And don't forget to try HubSpot's email signature generator. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a like and hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in our next video. Bye.